Hey guys, we're going to PE tip number 65. Um, and today I want to talk about sensitivity after either using the bathmate or the size genetic extender. Okay, so this was a question that was po a comment question that was posed on one of my videos. And I thought this was actually worth a, um, a video answering the question. Um, so, uh, first of all, let me talk about the size genetic extender. Generally speaking, generally speaking, um, if I wear the size genetic extender after six hours, I don't masturbate, edge, or have sex after using it because usually I am way fatigued and the skin is just agitated. So I don't even want anything touching that area. Okay, now that's me personally. Some people out there might do other things, and that's fine. That's fine. Okay. So, but for me personally, I can't really comment about sensitivity. Uh, let me let me actually explain what that they what people mean by sensitivity. Sensitivity means like after you use it, um, you climax faster. Okay, that that's basically what they're meaning. You, you're so sensitive down there that any sensation makes you climax. Okay, that's what we're talking about. Um, so like I said, after using uh, the size genetic extender, I usually don't even like to be. The area is just fatigued and really agitated, so I don't like to do any any of that. Now, the bathmate, on the other hand, it's the bathmate. Um, that's a different story because that this device, I actually, I can, I don't, I consider this more like a sex toy, guys, than like a. Um, well, I know it's used for male enhancement, but I, I generally use it. Um, generally use it the other way. Um, so, but that it, that that does bring this point about seventy time. I'd say about seventy percent of the times I am oversensitive. And when you really think about it, though, that makes sense, right? If if you are in an aroused state and you're using that thing for fifteen minutes straight, or not sorry, not fifteen minutes straight, but you know, you do the five break, five break. Um, by the end of it, you, I mean, you you, you know, what I mean, you've really put your penis through a not through a grinder, but you know what I mean, you've, you've really, um, you've pumped it, you've put pressure, um, on it, you've, you've, you've really, um, aroused, I, I get aroused from using it, so it, it's, it's, you know, having been in that state for a long time, you're ready to go, you're ready to climax, um, sometimes, I think about 40, 30, 30 percent of the times, though, I, it, it does seem to give me more stamina, um, but I would say I am generally more sensitive than stam than have like extra stamina after using it. So, anyways, guys, uh, to give you a solution to this problem, and this is something I I, I would like to do more of. Um, I I, I want to actually do this in the in the future, and if some people actually want to see this in the future. So, um, I call it, um, and I made a video about this maybe two weeks ago. Um, use the bath mate, right? Use the bath mate. And then right after you're done with your session, edge with a flashlight, like do an edging session. And you're trying to, so basically guys, you're trying to get to 5,000 strokes um, using this within an hour uh, following a bathmate session. Okay guys, that's this, That's what I am planning on doing uh, to quote unquote solve this problem. Because I think it is a problem. Because I think if you, if you could, like, let's talk like, Fantasy, fantasy, sex here for a minute, guys. Like, 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 how you would like to see yourself as a lover? If you could do have a bathmate session, be just rocking a huge size, and actually be able to put it to use for a rather long period of time, that would be that would be that would be ideal, right, guys? That that's that's like, that's like the dream for a lot of people, right? Be a kick-ass lover, okay? So. Um, but as with anything, kick, being a kick-ass lover takes practice, you know, dedication. It's not like, you know, you just do this once and boom, you're ready to rock every girl you meet world socks off. Like, you gotta, you gotta work up to it. And this has been a problem for me. This actually is a pr big problem for me. Like, the whole climaxing too early. I, so I sympathize with this. I actually, this, this actually, this question actually cut at me. I was like, man, that's a question I can get behind because that's a question... I have had problems with, and it's a, and it is, it is something I am dedicated to solving. I am, this is like, this is a problem I am dedicated to solving, guys. So, um, I, I will definitely, 
Um, I will definitely be doing that that project. Um, probably it will be after video 100, guys. Is probably after I do 100 videos of these tips. I'm gonna I'm gonna do. I don't know what I'm gonna change something a little bit. I'm gonna look at what you guys like, what you guys have been asking, and I'm gonna make another hundred videos based on that. And this th this might be the thing. This 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 might be the thing. Like what I just described here, getting to that five thousand strokes uh, post bathmate session, becoming an excellent lover. That might be the that might be the 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 problem I tackle next. Um, that that there's a lot like you so. Um, if that's something you guys would like to see, uh, leave a comment. Say, yeah, I'd, I'd like to see, I'd like to see you, you do that. Um, I'd like to see you tackle that problem. I'd like to see your journey to, um, go from being meh to great, right? I'd, I'd like to see that. Um, because like I said, that, that is a problem I've had, I've always had, and it would be nice to overcome it. Um, so... Yeah, I think that that I might do that next, or some, or, or in the, within this year, within this calendar year, I'll definitely start that. Um, like I said, there's a couple things I'm. I got a big, big, big list of things to put on this channel, guys. So it's just kind of like you know, I mean, I just go through it and check mark it one at a time. But that's this is definitely a thing. So like I said, guys, if you if you're having, if you're super sensitive after using the bath mate, like you climaxing quickly that's not that's not a you thing that happens to me too that generally happens to me in general though that is that is a problem for me so it is it is uh something i am really wanting to tackle and like i said i think it would be fun to do the the bathmate edging edging challenge um and actually dedicate a, a good amount of time to it because like i said the last challenge i tried to do i i was i have like 20 things on my plate I had 20 things on my plate i've reduced it down a lot so um, but yeah, guys, let me know if that's something you'd like to see, um, want me to, 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 to tackle, and I will, uh, if I get a tons of yeses, I'm gonna be like, alright, alright, that'll be, like, my next, like, thing I do on this channel after my 100th video. Um, so anyways, guys, that's, that's PE tip number, uh, 65. Um, I hope you have a wonderful day, and I will see you guys on the next PE tip.